It was early on the hot Friday night of July 27, 2007, when Officer George Cortez responded to a 911 call of a forgery in progress at a check cashing business near 83rd Avenue and Encanto Boulevard. The passer of a stolen check and his female accomplice were still in the store when Officer Cortez, serial number 8232, arrived. He was handcuffing the forger who twisted away, pulled a handgun, and fired directly at Officer George Cortez, fatally wounding him. The murder suspects fled into the night. Both were arrested less than nine hours later and found to be linked to a forgery ring. Officer Cortez was 23 years old and served on the department for two and a half years. He was survived by his wife Tiffany and their two sons. We honor his sacrifice. Thank you all for coming here to honor our lost officer, George Cortez. So with that, I would like to present uh, Tiffany and uh, George's mom. You guys all want to try to help Yeah, okay. Here you go. Woo! I'm Sergeant Jackie Wagaman of the Guest Ray Mountain Precinct, 32 Franks Supervisor. About six months ago, my officers came to me noticing that this location was not properly marked as a memorial for the officer George Cortez who had fallen four years ago. Officer Joe Vizzini, who works for me, was his original idea. The rest of the squad got on board, helped me with fundraising through PPLSA, through everything from selling nachos to taking dollar donations from the officers in the precinct to get together the plaques that were presented both on the wall today at the location and as well as to the family. I just want to thank everybody for this. It means a lot that people have not forgotten and that they're still here for us when we need them. And they're all very special to us. Thank you.